the um, Radiant Rain Misters, and these have been all shaken up by you guys. And I'm going to just uncover them and use a sponge. And I dip it in. And make sure they're mixed because if you mix them up really well and there's nothing on the bottom, all of the mica powders will be mixed in and you'll get a shimmering, a little shimmeriness to it, which is really nice. So what you're going to do is you're going to cover your bracelets. You can use whatever colors you want. You don't have to have them all be the same color. And there should be some of these, so a few of you can share colors of the rainbow. And I'll do the inside and sides of this as well. Oops. <laughs> Guess this one will be blue. <laughs> Go figure. Yay, we love blue. Oh. Hey. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. And it's going to be splattered on the inside. That'll oh. be really fun. Okay, oh. so we just make, oh, if you make fun out of mistakes. Don't you love it? Love it, love it, love it. So I'm just going to do the edge of this. There's no mistakes in our work. Well, there's garbage, and you throw it out the way. You don't need to see your bad work. Okay, there you go. So what I did was I found this ribbon that has a texture. Oh, yeah. And again, I'm kind of being messy because I'm trying to do this quickly. What I found is this ribbon, okay, that has texture. I'm taking another color that's complementary or darker. I'm going to wrap this around, and it'll give some texture to it, okay? And I'm not being super neat with it, as you can tell. If you need to wear um, uh, gloves. gloves, because you have to go to work tomorrow, I think we have gloves somewhere. Okay, so kind of made a snake, snake skin sort of pattern mm, right there. Cool. Yeah, that would. Yeah, so there we go. That's that one. And we'll do the same thing with this one. Again, my sponge was pretty damp. You can use anything for texture that you like. This one I'll put a little blue on. 